and I like stuff. Okay, right. I did stuff. I did like all this junk, and during this whole time, I, the only reason why I actually got up before I started stream was to fucking get a water bottle. I got up to get a fucking water bottle, and I did not get that. I did everything else but not get a fucking water bottle. I'm gonna play the music and I'm gonna get that real quick. So, Elemental came out on Disney Plus today, and I took a little gander at it, meaning I watched the whole movie. And I'll I'll, I'll talk I'll talk about what I think think about it when the starting soon ends. Hello, every pony. I just like saying every pony now. Bring it back to that again. Oh, so keeps throwing me off. That's completely valid, honestly. Especially the way um Wade, which is the if you don't know the water guy, especially the way he's kind of animated, kind of uh, it did throw me off in the beginning, but I got used to it because I think like. His animation got more tame uh, later on in the movie. It should have been 3D in my opinion. And I completely agree with you. It's just like, you know, nobody does 2D anymore. So really, what's the point? What's the point of arguing that someone's be that something should have been better in 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 two D when you know for a fact they're never gonna go back to two D animation? It sucks, but it's the reality of it. The only time you get to see two D animation nowadays is in animated shows. And even then, not everyone watches them because most of the time they're aimed toward, they're directed or aimed towards like a younger audience. So people automatically think like, oh, okay, I'm not going to watch it then. No! <laughs> they have to, I should have to pay people to do that work. Oh, yeah, that, yeah, you're so right. My bad. I forgot that they don't like paying artists. My bad. Hi, Mel. Welcome to the stream. in the real world forgot that they don't actually like paying the creative people that work on their movies in the first place my bad guys my bad let's just go back to doing ai stuff yeah absolutely let's get an ai bot to write the entirety of toy story 5 and you know what let's let's add a bunch of ai artists to do the animation for toy story 5 as well clearly because that's going to be perfect. AI princess. My name's Princess Jane. I have some I have some tricks I want to show you. I hope you enjoy it. Don't cry. God, I fucking love Paramoy. I'm sorry. Don't go quiet. <laughs> to your mama. Your own in the real world. Thank <laughs> you. 
I love you, Paramore. I love you, Paramore. Okay. <clears throat> so I kind of want to, you know, if I'm going to make a, make a new Sona, I want to do a ref sheet of it. Cause I think I'm actually like fully going into the whole new persona thingy. It's kind of bad. It's really bad timing that I want to do. Like now that, that now I want to do the fucking, um, new redesign. Same colors, kind of the same colors, yeah. It's just basically like an upgrade to make it easier for me to draw. Rayru, yeah, what's up? Yeah, what's up? I might make the the skirt a gradient, maybe. I'm not sure. Uh... Why is it bad timing? Because I just finished the emotes. That's why. The keychain that looks like uh looks very fluffy. You want to want to print what? Yes. Fucking explodes! Oh my god! Where's the? Where, where, where's? Where's the sound? Where's? Where where's the sound? Hello? Change my persona, I'm not changing those fucking emotes, I'm just making an all right hairstyle. <laughs> Where the fuck is the sound? Is it gonna be over here? It just did not show up. Hello? Stream elements? Hello? Not one of them I'm calling you. Just watch my wildest streams come true. Look at the silly sound. Where the fuck is it? Refresh. Uh, I set the silly keychain to a DM3. Let me see. <gasps> That's so cute! I'm definitely using that as inspo. Holy shit, that's so cute! Stream Elements ate the sub, I guess. I guess so. Oh, that's just drawings of me. Not bad. Actually, I should probably stop wasting canvases. <laughs> I'll just use this one. Oh, wait. I forgot I was supposed to talk about Elemental. Um, okay. Wait. Okay. So... So okay, so you sh so so it's a following sound, but not the sub sound. Okay, I get it. Um, Manal. Yeah, thank you so much for the follow. I appreciate it. So I watched Elemental. It came out today, like at midnight. So I was like, hey, okay, I'm I can finally give it a watch and make form my own opinion about it. So just you know getting mixed opinions on twitter.com and and i watched it and it was yeah it was, it was fine it was all right it was it was cute for the most part i'll be so honest like this might be biased because i'm like a sucker for romance in a sense but the main two were honestly really cute you watched what elemental over hyping it honestly a tiny bit it wasn't the best romance i've seen obviously it's not the it's definitely not the best thing ever i can tell you that um 
I definitely one of my I think one of my biggest issues with the movie was that the pacing was really weird, especially in the beginning of the movie because you you're like thirty three minutes in and like um just like they're or they're already like going on dates and shit like whoa 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 like you already got it's it's definitely like the pace for me the pacing's really off and also like. Um, well, they don't really take the time. It's, this is what I'm also, this is also kind of like connecting with like the pacing, but like they don't really, I, I feel like they don't really give us enough time to really make us like really be invested in these two as a like a couple or relationship. Like you, you get, you get scenes here and there of them look, giving them that specific look, right? You know, that fucking look where they're just like, they're just like, oh, wait, wait. <laughs> This specific look, they 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 give they do to they do like two fucking scenes <laughs> in the beginning of the movie where both um Wade and Ember give each other like these kind of looks. To and that's like kind of the only thing we kind of get to show that like um that like there's something going on, but like they I feel like they don't really give more attention to like like they're they're i don't know i guess it's just some i guess it might just be a me thing because i won't lie i think i'm on the romantic spectrum but, like, i won't lie but like I, I feel like that it was a little too quick you know it, it was a little <laughs> It it was it go it went a little too fast, don't you think? Like you guys just met, you guys just like, holy. <laughs> I, I... Like. Done it done it thousand times already. Um. Eh. Yeah. Yeah. I I think just my my main issue is it's like specifically the pacing and and how they build up their the two the main two's relationship because like oh when you really like think think about it yeah those two are cute but we haven't really seen what really like like okay we can we can see. We we know what like Wade sees in fucking in Ember, right? Cause he woke he like verbalizes a lot. He he talks a lot. He's he's he like he's very verbal about his, his feelings for her. But like she doesn't do the same. And I guess that is part of her character in a sense, but like we will I would also love to see what she sees in him, you know? I mean, I know what I see of him. He's kinda silly. <laughs> He's kind of pathetic, I won't lie. <laughs> Race allegory needs to be buried now. Megan time to let it go. I'll be so honest with you. Like you get um there's there it, what not even not even like I think it was five minutes into the movie and there's already like like immediate racism thrown at you and I'm like holy shit like wh whoa the race allegory because it's like a whole race allegory thing the um with like the elements yeah either way just it's a fine movie. People definitely bashed on it for no reason. I I want to see this, but also 
it's it's understandable why people were bashing on it because the advertising for that movie was so fucking bad. Like there was that what that one fucking TikTok of showing like the little grass kid. When you actually watch the movie, he only has like maximum two minutes of screen time, out of the what like the one out like almost two hours of screen time. The advert, the marketing, the advertisements for that for that fucking movie was so bad. They they genuinely hated that movie. Like they made you think that fucking gra- that fucking grass kid was gonna be in the entire fucking movie and be like the com- the the comedic character and the person that all like the fucking the the all oh, the kids will love this one. No, he's in there for like two minutes. <laughs> Tangled solos, tangled fucking solos. The the fucking the fucking um the boat scene still makes me fucking fold up, crumble up, and die every time I I I, I even hear it. Every time I was literally literally my parents are my parents are watching it in the living room, right? My parents were watching it in the living room and they got to they were watching Tangled and they got to that specific fucking scene. And oh, and I, I I heard it from my room, and I was just like, "Oh my god!" <laughs> Tangled is genuinely like one of my favorite um Disney movies, specifically when it comes to building romance and everything. That's just that the romance part of the movie, because like. Eugene's and and Rapunzel's fucking relationship is you you can you see it build up you see why they like each other you see it like you see the chemistry and then like and I don't... <laughs> Also, uh, to answer your question, the grass kid is the one who had like a cro- uh, like I guess a quote unquote crush on Ember, but like he doesn't go any farther than than just giving her a flower from his armpit. I'll I'll I'm gonna be real with you. He he's just a stupid ass kid that has a crush on a you know. A lady who is way too old for him. <laughs> From where his armpit? The area that is underneath your arm. I really cannot stand the beginning of that fucking movie. I'm so serious. The blatant racism is so. Oh. Wait, what was I drawing again? Oh, right. I don't know. I think the I think the more better part of the movie is like the middle or like nearing towards the end, because you just kind of see them, you know. Just be a couple. Be just just be in love with each other. I guess like the I. I wish we could find hello. No, they can't have that. They they can't have that though. You, you gotta know that by now. Like it was pretty. I'll be I'll be honest. I didn't know he was when I when I watched when I was watching the movie. I didn't know he was gonna die. When he did, I was already like, okay, they're gonna bring him back, though. <laughs> like, he's...
Mother Goth, they no, not only did they kill like murder Mother Gothel, but they literally showed Eugene getting fucking stabbed. So like and and bleeding out. And dying. <laughs> so <laughs> I don't know what to think anymore. <laughs> Bring back murdering. Hello, Mufasa died. Bambi's mom died. Yeah, but those are we're talking more like just modern Disney because the old Disney, yeah, they would definitely kill off a villain or just a character for the sake of the story. Like the, the they honestly did that a lot with especially the parents of said main character. They would do that a lot. What am I doing again? Oh, dry, drying rep sheet. Fuck shit, okay. Do I have any better brushes? Fuck my day! You used to see animated characters getting murdered on screen. I'm never doing that again. <sighs> Do I want to use my brush? I guess. I guess. Oh my god, I cannot draw. I mean, also, I did, like... I, like, folded over, crumpled up, and died when, like, I would just hear, like, Wade. I guess, just, like... Vocalize his, his love forever. I'll, I'll be real with you guys. That that shit made me want to... In, in a good way. Like, it made me want to... We need to have more relationships when, when the, when the, we need to have more, I had to specify this, and we need to have more straight relationships where the, where the, the male is way more in love than the female is. Because I, I'll be honest with you, I love seeing that shit so much. I love seeing, like, just, oh my god. For why bro did not get the hints, Jesus Christ. <laughs> Female fell first, male fell harder. <laughs> Pathetic male absolutely head over heels for a pretty, for a very pretty and out of his league woman. You get it. You get it. You fucking get it. God, I love pathetic men. <laughs> Holy shit. In, in the fictional sense. In the fictional sense.
Uh, love me, uh, it's a, it's a trope, it's that trope if you want to read it. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Pathetic male leads? Oh my god. Is Keep and Loafer? And if yes, is it good? I've heard it's pretty good. I, and I also, like, I do really want to watch it as well. I heard, But I've heard it's really good. People say it's cute. That, for what it looks like, it's really cute. Oh my god, I just got remember I just got fucking reminded. I just got fucking reminded. The fucking the dancing scene, like the whole scene when when Rapunzel and Eugene are in the fucking town and they're dancing and then like they're reading books together and like he's just watching her dance and have fun and then oh my god I can't say what I want to say because I'm live on Twitch. Oh, Pickled proves love isn't dead. For And then the the whole scene ends with, with, like, with everyone dancing together. And then the whole dance part ends when Eugene and Rapunzel get paired up together. At in the end, guys, guys, I just, I I don't think I, I I don't think I can do this anymore. <laughs> I hate it here so much. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 I, I don't want to risk it. Disney isn't doing it as they used to. Just, just like in in the romance sense, especially like they 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 are doing it as they used to. Disney and Pixar. I don't think Pixar is really focused on stuff with romance, right? Right? No, it's mainly Disney. Yeah, no, they they are doing it. As as they used to, 
they really did peak with like with, with in terms of romance they they peaked with both Tangled and Princess and the Frog in my opinion. Sure, was there, uh, she rejected him because she was unsure and not ready for, for the commitment and Eugene fucking apologized to her it told her he would wait I'm just gonna <clears throat> I'm just I'm just gonna take take a sip of water, I'll be honest. <laughs> oh god, I did I did you start fucking choking on my water. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. Think of your channel. Oh, yeah, you're right. <laughs> My bad. I just won't do that next time. <laughs> Anyways, I hate bitches in love so much. It's not fair. It's, it's... <laughs>
Hi, Sue. I also, I love Princess and the Frog because I just love how, like, like, hard, like, the bean was falling for Tiana. I thought that was really, I thought that was really cute. It's always like that fucking, it's, again, I'm, I'm telling you, I'm telling you, it's always that fucking look that they always animate. That is just like... <laughs> the look, you know what look I'm talking about. You know what look I'm talking about. Rio Romeo, maybe. <laughs> I love tragic lesbian. Oh my god, you, you get it. I, I, um. I there's a specific uh, Rio Romeo song that I like I listen to and I imagine my OCs in it my lesbian OCs Which one? It's a uh, Butch for Butch, I'm pretty sure. Good choice, thank you. <laughs> thank you. What are you drawing? A uh, rough shape for my new Sona design. Panda Cookie Lover, thank you so much for the follow, I appreciate it. And also thank you Sweet Cherry, Space Dorito, and so Nico's for the follow as well. I appreciate it all so much. Thank you, thank you. Welcome to the stream. I'm gonna eat you way you draw just a nibble. No. No, I need this, please. <laughs> I need this, please. Please. You're so fucking weak. What do you mean? <laughs> Guys, please, save, save, guys, please, I need this, guys, please, I need this, I need this. I'm greedy, I'm sorry, what the fuck? Did you make a new overlay? I did, but, like, I'm not gonna put it in yet. Guys, guys, please! You guys remember when I would like, um, whenever I'd actually when during during the times when I when I actually finished art, um, on stream. Freaking uh, what you call it? You guys would ask me if you guys can eat it <laughs> when, <laughs> when 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 I was done. I remember that. You frame my phone as you speak? What the hell? What the fuck?
Oh shit, this is like half of the canvas. Do you guys ever get, like, headaches when you put yourself in front of a fan for too long? Hello, welcome to the stream. Thank you so much for the follow. I appreciate it. Okay, let's be realistic here. I don't know how that body shape. Guys are fans, what? So basically, this ha this happens to me a lot. Um, whenever I put myself in front of a fan for too long, um, I t I I tend to get like a like it's not a really bad headache. It's it, but it's enough to like you know, show like present itself. You know, it's it's there. If it's for too long, yeah, okay, yeah. So I'm not the only one then. This is some food. All right. I want to see you again. The fuck away from me. <laughs> see Pokemon X Hot and Miku collapse. I have. They're really cool. Also, I heard that Patsune Miku is coming to California. I'm really excited. I love Patsune Miku. Hello, welcome to the stream. I'm just gonna give myself these feet right now because I'm too lazy to like actually draw feet. To the follower well yippee let's be real here i'm not that tall i always have to do that every fucking time i'm drawing myself like my or like like my sona i always have to fucking shrink down the legs it's for for some reason i have a habit of drawing long legs but i know for a fact i am not tall Guys, what is <clears throat> what is a fictional like like couple slash ship that everyone loves but you like absolutely fucking hate? Like you you hate looking at it, you despise it with every fiber of your being.
Well, not really. You don't have to despise. You don't have to like fucking hate it with all your heart. But like, just something that you don't really like or prefer. Tall if you want. Mm -mm. It doesn't look right to me. I'm sorry. I can't do it. I can't do it. I can't make myself tall. It, does, it would not look right to me. Not sure. Honestly, that's fair. Oh, it's this song. This song. Music, we make it our natural. But I can't let her see me soon. Oh, is that slowly sent into madness? You get it. Hello, welcome to the stream. Thank you so much for the follow. I appreciate it. Then I forgot uh, the question. What was it? The question is basically like, what's a, what's a, a canon like fictional couple or like a ship that everyone in the community likes or like the majority of people in the in said community likes but you just don't like it or don't prefer it Check your DMs. Okay. <laughs> what the fuck? Bakuda, you, you know, that's that's exactly what I was referencing when I was asking that question. I don't understand it. I don't understand what people see in it. Like with, with Deku and Todoroki, I I can see it because like, um, season two, I think where it's like, he helps him learn about his powers. I think, and yeah, you know what? Yeah, one scene, one singular scene. Eh. That's my main thing is I don't understand like Baku Deku. It's enemies to lovers, but but why? Why they never? And for, from what I have seen, Baku has never showed like any actual fucking chance of redemption. And especially towards with with Deku, the literal guy that he bullied i don't care that they're childhood friends i do not give a shit if they're childhood friends he literally told him to kill himself like in a, in a, in a genuine ma manner And he has done nothing but be an absolute dick to Deku the whole fucking time. You are like that? Yeah, well, like... It's a really, you know... 
I don't know. I don't get it. Can I talk about other fandoms? Go ahead. So it would be in it was a horror series where he actually Oh Jesus. Is that really a crack ship? Because like isn't just crack isn't crack shipping like when you take two characters who have just not interacted at all or shown little to no interest in each other? Not really in the sense like like oh they don't like each other like that more so like they do not care about each other they do not talk to each other they do not see their presence they do not perceive them isn't that like and you just put them together like oh my god they're so in love isn't isn't that crack shipping you're talking about rare pairs oh fuck I, I, my bad i don't know the the shipping terms <laughs> My bad, guys. It's your popular shit we, and you're happy there's more art but now it's not your silly head can anymore. I feel like you're speaking this from personal experience. Who the hell are you, what what ship are you talking about? <laughs> I'm I'm genuinely curious now. Do not like stu- Oh! Why would you say that in my presence? Mm-mm. <laughs> This is too much of a serious photo, yeah, I'll be honest. LA Fry? Oh. I didn't know people shipped them, that's cool. How silly do you want to be, Brie? Silly. I'm not serious. I can I can when I when I want to be, but just not all the time. Hello, welcome to the stream. Nah, you mentioning a fucking dong and rumpa ship.
Can I get a kid? See the whole revamp streams like an approximation? Huh? I don't know. I want. I'm. I. I'm. I'm not that professional. I don't. I don't. I can't give an approximate time. I. I kind of have a life too. I'll try to get it done as soon as I can. And don't say anything. Oh, yeah, you're right. <laughs> What's left? I still gotta do stuff outside of just drawing it, drawing stuff. I like I gotta freaking. I gotta do Discord stuff. I gotta do Twitter stuff. It's just all just so I gotta do social media stuff as well. Free VTuber debut? Oh my god. Even Twitter? It's so, just all, just any of my social medias, man. Like Discord, I understand it's the most awaited one, but Twitter, I'm most active on Twitter. <laughs> like Twitter is where I I got my fault my my following in the first place, so. Ain't no way. <laughs> the alerts are not working. Oh, there you go. I need to think of silly poses. Rah. No, I'm just gonna make this whole canvas filled with poses and we'll see what we think. Ultra silly layout re I wanna have just those like I wanna be like one of those fucking categories that have that just just have a goofy ass profile picture of like their their character Your peak silly. Whoa. My silliness. By the way, Brick, yeah. What's up?
Oh, wait, it's like that. Okay. Cause I got switch. Oh my gosh! No freaking way. Ray, what's up? Yeah, what's up? The thumb. Is oh, it's on the wrong fucking side. Oh my fucking god! Thank you, Lumi. That means the fucking no, the rest of the hand. Oh my god, the rest of the hand. Oh, <laughs> it's all fucked up. It's over. It's over. It's over. It's over. It's fucking over. I can't take this shit anymore. I'm just gonna do it like... Because this is, this is a pose for right now. This is a pose out of many I'm probably going to do to see which one I, I want to actually do. I need to learn how boobs work in, in, the, in, the, in the sense of anatomy. <laughs> Melon. Fuck. Drooping bubbles. <laughs> he pounced. He pounced. Okay, thank you guys. Thank you. Thank you guys. I could always count on you guys for that one. Thank you. Tom Bunny re era? Yes, I do. I don't know why I didn't think about it sooner. Like, I was, I was at the. When I still had that Sona, I was still, like, I was already making my characters bunny related. Like, my Hulk characters. I wanna be pale, love soldiers, I want closure. Not heart shaped anymore, because mm -mm, they're fucking annoying to draw when they're heart shaped. <laughs> that's one pose let's just pose um number 
one. Think we want to draw it? You should. I'm back. Welcome back. Even if you're not gonna make it, um, you're really messing in the Discord server. Um, nothing will really change. It's just like I'm not. I don't plan on doing anything special with it. I just kind of want to start fresh, you know. Um, I I do I I'm I feel like I do that often where I just kind of re redo everything and start fresh. Cause I I I feel more better than to just like i don't know Uh, yeah, uh, Discord server is nothing really. Not gonna be that. Like, different. It's not gonna be anything. Special or new, it's just gonna be deleting the old one and then building a new one. Thumbs up. Suppose I did? Yes. I just really wish it could be revived. I'm gonna be real with you. I don't think it can. That's why I'm redoing it all. What pen are you uh, using? It looks nice. It's called... Uh... L. I think that's how you say it. <gasps> that's cool. Boy. Six feet under, it is. It really is. <laughs> I won't lie. I'm gonna hit that with the super react. Hold on. <laughs> Take a crack at it. I think you did good. Of course, of course. <laughs> I'm so like I'm so learning perspective. I gotta do I gotta learn how to do like that fucking the block thing that people that people who actually know how to do perspective do. I need to learn that shit. He's gonna give it a new uh breath. The what? It's like it's like a square thingy that they do to represent it's it's like a box it's like a box people they people who know how to do perspective they do a box you don't know how to do that i do it's just i need to get better at it <laughs> cuz i'm i'm really rusty with it i never do any back i never do backgrounds that's why
uh by redoing the whole thing do you think oh, wait do you think it's gonna give a new breath i like a breath of fresh air i i think so i don't i don't know it's just it's it's a discord server it's it's really it maybe i'll consider doing some like special stuff with with people in the server but as of right now i am really busy like i and i'm also just not the most social person Like especially when it comes to meeting new people, I am not the best with that. I I, I cannot. It's hard for me. But I will never want to fall in love again. For your mouth, I will never fall in love again. Oh god. Jesus. Okay. Gotta go to school. Good luck at school. What if I gave my skirt pockets? That wouldn't work. Would it? <laughs> I remember, um... My freaking... My, my mom, she got me, um... She got me... She bought me a dress, right? And she told me, you know, I think you would like this one. And I asked her why, and she said, because it has pockets. And I'm like, oh my god! <laughs> and then she lets me borrow one of her cardigans, and um, she tells me, you grab that specific one because it has pockets. And I'm like, oh my god! <laughs> this woman knows I love pockets. The superior kind of dresses, for real! I fucking love dresses with pockets! I hate, no, I hate it when I used to have, like, those shorts or, like, those, that, that, those specific t, like, t-shirts that would, that would have those little, like, like, the fucking, like, those fucking shirts that would be like this, right, and then, like, it would have, like, this little thing right here, right? Mo the ones, I, I know usually some people have ones that actually open up, mine did not, mine never opened. And it was so fucking annoying. And I I I have these like pair of pants as well. I think they're I think it's pants or shorts. Either way, um, I think I'm just, I'm just I'm just gonna make the pants. 
So I have these pair of pants, right? And there's front pockets, right? But surprise, surprise. Surprise, surprise. The front pockets are fake. They don't open up. They don't fucking work. But the back ones do. So every time I'm going out with these fucking pair of pants on, I always have to put like sh put sh shit like my phone or whatever on th in the back pockets. Like, why can't you just make? Why can't you just let them work? Why can't you just open them? I don't get it. Whose idea was it to fucking to just to just fucking rub it in people's faces that they have they have they have no functioning pockets in their clothes it's so fucking annoying i hate that shit that's like a real that's like a real peeve a real pet peeve of mine when it comes to fashion It's actually a patch, but it's been so close. It's so fucking annoying. Let's pose number two. I'm not doing the legs because I don't really feel like it. Also, this is just a, pref a personal preference of mine when it comes to like shit, like when it comes to specific sweaters. I like the sweaters. Um, what do you call it? I like the sweaters that don't have this, like the the zipper. I just like it when sweaters are just like that, like no no zippers, none of that. Hi Puffles. Yeah, I just I just like um wouldn't let me follow you for a solid five minutes. I was fighting the button. Hello. <laughs> I'm so sorry about that. <laughs> well welcome to the stream. <laughs> Thank you so much for the follow. I appreciate it. Yeah, I hate, I hate, I, I, I don't hate it, but I don't prefer sweaters with like a zipper on it, with it. Also, if a sweater does not have pockets, I do not want it. If if it if a sweater does not have these po these specific pockets, I don't want it. I I don't fucking want it. It needs, it needs pockets for me to live. <laughs> How can I live in those conditions where I just don't have a pocket in my fucking sweater? Who lives like that? <laughs> the hood 
and big pocket. You get it. You get it. Mm, what are some other poses I can do? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What is this? So how, you, how long did it take you? Uh, usually it takes me about like a couple of days to do this, like the PNG tuber. <laughs> takes me a couple of days, so a week at best. So, uh, not really a week. I just kind of get lazy, but um, it takes me a minimum three days, max five, I think. I always forgot how to draw my own OC. Me too! Me too! Character OCs, only creature, that's a fair. Touch my OC in a month, oh boy.
I kind of want to give my persona a little smug look. So I know I'm an awkward mess, but like, I'm also... Not all the time. I like giving- I like giving my little character a fucking smug-ass look. How do you create a character? Sometimes against, uh, I get a clear image of my mind, I can't think- draw it. I say- I say my best- my best, um, suggestion for you. Really think about the theme you want to go with this character. Like, what specific, um, genre of outfits or like what what is what is their vibe and everything think of their theme their vibe and kind of just go with the flow of that because i do i do that with my ocs i think about how i want them to like how i want to present them how i because usually just my character design alone is supposed to um it's supposed to i like define a character like it's supposed to describe a character with just design alone most of the time sometimes sometimes it doesn't it doesn't apply to all characters but majority of the time it that's how it is and you really gotta think about like just just the theme the overall theme you want this character to like throw off and then you could just add in the details like the like with outfits it's, it's especially with outfits you could just add in little details here and there but like if you got to get like this the main the main key parts of the outfit down I'm in chat. Bye bye. Take care. Because one before I was uh, so try a skill issue and I need to learn the stuff. I I managed to anatomy and stuff. It was still a struggle. It's really um creating a character. Any anyone can create a character. Honestly, like um. Even people who don't have the skill, like, the art skills, can still create a character. It's just a matter of knowing how to and getting that inspiration and that motivation to create said character. Character can be, yeah, the character can be as simple or complex as you want it to be. It's your character at the end of the day. And don't and, and trust me when I say this. Do not worry if you're making a Mary Sue character. Do not worry about that shit. Okay. Cause I feel like ever since the like the term Mary Sue has be has become like a a wide wide known thing with with artists and especially especially those who make OCs. It's kind of like affected the way people view creating characters, and um. It it's it's basically it basically makes them it makes it makes a a character writer or designer feel limited in a sense because it's a fear of going too far to the point where your character will, will be called a Mary Sue. Um, a basic term, a basic term for like a Mary Sue is just like, um, imagine like your character is, you, you're basically, you, you make a character that, that is too like overpowered or too, like the design is too complex or bright or whatever.
that that's the best that's i think that's the best i can the, the best like definition of a mary sue i can give So overly OP, too perfect character. Yeah, basically. My favorite character is a Mary Sue, technically. Who? <laughs> Wait. Oh, Saki. I should really, I should really watch that. I was watching, I saw some clips from, on, on TikTok of Saki K, and I, I thought that was really funny. <laughs> like, I saw, I saw, the specific clip I saw was like, it was like a blue haired chick, and she's basically so full of herself that she thinks like, Saki would like, fold for her, basically. Cause it was she like she always she's like constantly laughing like, like I'm such an I'm like such a nice and like great person like I'm so nice they would always like, say hi to me. It was really cute about her 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 apparently what's up. According to what I've heard. I it's how the mangaka view his wife. Oh, that's actually so cute. <laughs> Wait. That's so fucking cute. I love it when, like, um, when creators tend usually base off characters or, like, a story off of their life or, like, their, 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 someone they know in their life i always find that really like silly of course we're per perfect and loved by everyone oh oh my god Only watching the first season in dub. Damn. What happened to the second season? Replace all the VAs? What? Why? What the fuck? That's worse than what Crunchyroll did to fucking Mob Psycho. What the hell? Now, what Crunchyroll did to Mob Psycho is genuinely so fucking annoying. Are you doing Sona poses? I am. Boop. No, you you'd be surprised the, the amount of characters people have made. It, it's not really like characters that like are in are in like famous media. It's more so just uh characters that people online have made. It was basically it's a Mary Sue is just basically a character that has zero flaws, zero has has like done nothing wrong ever, um can do no wrong, and is like loved is loved by everyone 
You, you know, that, that kind of shit. Basically, just imagine, like, fucking, um, Metro Man from Mega Man. <laughs> do, do you ever struggle with anatomy in your life? Yes. <laughs> Like, take right now, for example. Holy shit. You would think, like, hair color can be considered a flaw? Uh, I'm talking about flaws more in the sense that, like... Um, when writing their character, hair, hair and stuff is more just like a, a design clusterfuck, basically. It, like if you're blonde, you're labeled as dumb in, in a stereotypical person way. Well, really the only way you would fulfilled that stereotype is if you make a a dumb blonde character and like if you if you per if you purposely made the character blonde and dumb then i guess yeah but sometimes that's not really the case does your new sona ha design have new clothes uh eh? I mean, yes and no. It's just it's just a, it's just an upgraded version of my current Sona. Like I my one of my OCs is a blonde, but like he's he's saying he's, he's that, that doesn't mean he's dumb. It's just really all depending on how you write the character and how you, like, decide this character's personality and traits and all that stuff. Who has pupils and who has it when you draw? You, what, what do you mean by that? Like, wait, pause. What do you mean by wait? What do you mean by that? Like, your OCs have them, but you don't? Like, the way I draw eyes? Wait, I don't... Wait, huh? The way I draw eyes is very specific to the character. So, like, I have an OC whose eyes are, like... The, probably the most detailed eyes you've ever seen in your life. Well, they're not really detailed here, but, like, I'm trying to give an example. And then, like, she has stars in her eyes. Those, not, those are not stars.
I have an OC that has that has a very detailed like very detailed eyes, and that those are her eyes are supposed to be important to um her story. But then I also have a character whose eyes are just just. Just, just that. Just like that. So. It. My, my persona had, I just, I just tend to draw eyes differently all the time. My my I the way I draw eyes is not really that consistent. It, it is, but also isn't at the same time. Gotta go now. Bye bye bye. Take care. For perfect to exist, yeah. In, in the end of the day, per like making a perfect char character is impossible. Right, it it that can apply to everything. Writing the perfect story is impossible. Making the perfect character is impossible. Perfect character design is possible. It's impossible. But just anything perfect, making anything perfect, is impossible because nothing is perfect. I would take that job. That's cool. I look I like villains. I like villains a lot. I think villains are really cool. Gotta go bye bye bye. Good luck with school. I love Farquaad. I just like I just like villains who are so irredeemable. Bro, go to school. You already said bye. Go to school.
Cartoonia at the end. character how I'm gonna try to make it wait I'm gonna try to try it on my witchy character my braid yeah yeah yippee animation yippee not really <laughs> I hate animating so much Oh, what? Wait, it's already almost six? Oh, shit. Which which pose are we thinking, chat? Sure. Maybe if I, like, adjust this one a bit. I just, I just, I just processed what's, I, I just processed. I, I, I just processed which song this is. I love this song. Are you ending yet? Why? You know what? I'll I'll, st I'll stream a bit longer just for you, Floor. Get in VC. <laughs> Get in VC, Floor. And in love. I four. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god, you sound so fucking tired. I just like like you don't understand. I woke up a minute ago. A minute ago. Dude. Here wait. Mom, you have to wake up at this time because you have to do your work and also because you have to go to lunch today with us. And I was like, okay. I woke up two minutes before my alarm, which is nine AM. Jesus. Bro wakes up and immediately checks stream. Listen, listen, I got priorities. <laughs> and priorities is to see if you're on live. Have you seen my my redesign of my Sona yet? What? Oh. <laughs> Look, are you looking at my stream? I'm watching. Bro, why did you redesign and you just been okay? I don't want to talk about it. You know what? Here, this is what it looks like. Oh, oh my god! Oh my! I lost an earring in my sleep. Well, <laughs> sorry. Hello. I was around. And I just realized that. Okay, so there's. The... I found the earring. We are good. That's good. Why were you sleeping with earrings on? Because um, I don't want my piercing holes to close. Fair enough. So I have to wear them. Oh my god, your character looks so cute. You look like a hippie in a good way, though. Bro. No, I don't want to so go cute. through with this. No, it's so cute. Like, instead of you being like, uh, like, you know, beforehand, always look like a, like, a, like, you know, a regular sized bunny. Now you look like a tiny bunny. You know, the itty bitty ones, the really cute ones. Yes, yes. Yeah, now your sona looks like that, and it's so cute. So, what about the, um, redesigned emotes? I'm not doing that. I'm not doing that right now. I'm not worrying about that right now. That's just gonna. That's mm -hmm. just gonna like make me wanna 
die. I won't lie. Okay, gotcha. Hello, welcome to the stream. See, I like the third pose, mainly because it's the one I spent the most time on. But I also, I also do like the first one as well. Mm, I mean, they all look good, so. Can it's kind of funny how you, how you abandoned the hair things, bro. Those are gone. I'm chopping those shit, those fucking things off. Brie had a haircut. They're fucking, they're fucking <gasps> chopped off, gone. Forever. It's gone forever. It's Chopper, isn't it? Isn't it? I'm so eepy. I can't, I, I don't even know what you said. I just knew you said something. <laughs> Dude. So you saw the the VMAs at uh, Stray mm -hmm. Kids thing, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah, I just I just saw my parents watching it and um I saw Stray Kids was performing and I told them like, oh this is this is the K pop group for likes. <laughs> and they and they won they won an award! Yay! Didn't Taylor Swift win like, win like nine awards there? I don't know. That's what I heard. I don't know, I don't listen to Taylor Swift, so... I didn't know you streamed. I've been following you on Twitter for so long, OMG. Hello! Yeah, I've been streaming for like two years. <laughs> Hello! Welcome to the stream. You really need to advertise? I thought I advertised enough! Do we gotta be making- Do we gotta be make- Making the freaking um... The going live tweets again? Do I gotta put live whenever I'm live? Do I gotta change my, my display name to live every time I'm I'm live on Twitch? Maybe. <sighs> I hope not. <laughs> I guess I did it. Fuck. Okay. <laughs> Shit. My bad, guys. But how how do I advertise that I stream? How do how do I advertise my Twitch channel more? Like I genuinely don't know how how they do it. How like the actual content creators do it? Your face, so I can sub to you. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Thank you so much. <laughs> oh. Stream for five to fifteen minutes and post a tweet and screenshot of what you're working on. I should I should do that I should do that thing I used to do where I like I would tell you guys to say hi to like hi to to Twitter or to Instagram and in chat. Oh oh my god. Hopefully soon I can go back to streaming at five PM. Oh my god, I hope so. 
I loved I I love streaming at like 5 p.m. Interaction Bay EMP. <laughs> I love interaction bait. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Was interaction bait again? It's when you make a tweet that um it's where you make a tweet like say let's say like you make a tweet saying like um reply with the most recent image you have saved on your phone and you basically you get everyone in their goddamn grandmother to reply that's interaction bait it's just it's just a way to get people to um Interact with your tweets. And in this case, it's it's more so just a way to like get more people chatting. You told me you fell in love with him and on his island. <gasps> <sighs> Floor CMing me. I'm gonna look as I'm playing Minecraft and getting ready for school. Minecraft! I love Minecraft. I'm gonna be so real, my head is hurting really bad. Like the headache is getting worse. Brie, go sleep. I I should. Wait, you I remember should. when I would play Minecraft on an SMP. Man, I remember when I used to play on an SMP. <laughs> I remember when Minecraft. Yeah. 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 Yeah, I, I might just go to sleep because my headache is actually like. EP time me, for Bree. Me, yeah, it's making me go wanna, EP. Like, explode and die. EP. EP. Uh, let's see if I can raid someone. Honk shoo, honk shoo. Oh my god, the fucking boobs again! <laughs> Excuse me? <laughs> the oil the titties, literally! Girly, what are you doing? <laughs> Where are these? Okay, okay, that's enough. That's enough Twitch. Oh, I tried. I tried. I, you know, I tried. All right, I'm. I'm just gonna end stream. You, you guys get to roam and be free and, and scatter. I don't. I. I... <laughs> Bye. I'll. I'll stream tomorrow. <laughs> Bye, guys. <laughs> Good night, everyone. Good night.